After a historic road win over Alabama, Ole Miss will now focus on the Vanderbilt Commodores. We play a very dangerous team this week, in my opinion. Um, Derek is uh, – his team is playing extremely hard for him defensively. I think they're really good. The Commodores' defense is only giving up an average of 17 points per game and limiting opponents to an average of 270 yards, something that Freeze says is a product of Vandy head coach Derek Mason's scheme. He takes pride in his defense, and you can tell they play extremely hard and have a really good scheme. Although Freeze is concerned about Vandy's defense, the Commodores are a weaker opponent than Alabama. Ole Miss linebacker Christian Russell says that won't affect the Rebels' mindset heading into Saturday's game. Yeah, we're going in with the same, you know, um, determination and motivation. Of, you know, it's not about the opponent, it's about us. You know, we handle our business and take care of what we have to take care of, and we'll be fine. Another concern for the Rebels is injuries. Ole Miss will play without defensive back Tony Connor, who's expected to miss a minimum of four weeks with a meniscus tear. Other key players are also hurt. Uh, Justin Bale is, is questionable this week. Bridges is questionable this week. Conyers is questionable this week. And uh, got to get Rod Taylor back, uh, back in the flow of things. The Rebels will kick off against the Commodores at 6 p.m. on Saturday at Vaught Hemingway Stadium.